The 25th day of October, 1935. The death of Maximilian, commander of the Empire's invasion of Gallia, paved the way for truce between the two nations. After seven tumultuous months at war, Gallians everywhere looked forward to a time of hard-won peace. Squad 7 of the Gallian militia disbanded shortly after the conflict's conclusion. And its members began to move on, each following his or her own path. And here, at the end of their long struggle, I lay my pen to rest. Noch nie hat ein Side-Character wie Leon so einen epischen Auftritt, das müsst ihr schon zugeben. Nun ja, und das war nun das Ende von Valkyria Chronicles. Ich hoffe, es hat euch sehr gut gefallen, denn mir hat es fantastisch gefallen. Ich liebe dieses Spiel, ich könnte es sofort nochmal durchspielen. Ein wenig Feedback wäre dementsprechend auch noch erwünscht. Äh, vielleicht, ihr wollt, müsst nicht, don't care. Naja ah doch, do care. Und... Nun ja, recht viel mehr habe ich dazu nicht zu sagen. Das Spiel ist vorbei. Es ist ein wunderbares Spiel. Ich liebe es. Und nun ja, das war's von meiner Seite aus. Jetzt noch viel Spaß bei den Credits und bye bye.
Mr. G! You gotta take us bug hunting again soon, okay? You bet. You know, I think you're ready for my top secret hunting spot. Yippee! Thank <laughs> you! We'll see you tomorrow! Yep. Go right along home now. Welkin Gunther. After the war, he returned to his studies. Many had thought the Galleon hero would rise to further fame, but Welkin had something else in mind. He returned to Bruel, there to realize his long-held dream of becoming a teacher. On weekends, he's often seen taking his students out on nature hikes. His is a peaceful civilian life, and he would have it no other way. Choosing Alicia's. Hey, honey. How's business today? Hey. Hey, you. What a surprise. Guess what? So I started selling the smoked cheese bread today, and everybody loves it. Of course. Told you that bread was great. Guess everyone in town agrees with me. Yeah. <laughs> Alicia Gunther. Trading in her rifle for a rolling pin, Alicia trained around the clock to pursue her dream. After many long months, she received her national certification as baker. On the same day, she married her sweetheart, Welkin Gunther. Together, the two opened Alicia's Bakery. It didn't take long for word to spread about her delicious creations. And now, even visitors from far away make a point of stopping to sample her fresh baked bread. How about you? How are your classes today? Ah, uh, you know, those kids never seem to run out of questions. <laughs> you know, they're amazing. Their curiosity's endless. That's so. Then you're a kid, too. You're as incurably curious as any one of them. <laughs> Speaking of kids, how's Isara been today? Mike? <gasps> Papa! Hey there! Have you been a good girl? Yep, I was real good. I was just helping Mama make some bread. I needed the dough all by myself. Oh, I wish you could have tasted the bread that dough made. Our customer said it was the best ever. Hey, Isara, that's really great. All right, you show me how and I'll help, okay? Yay! Come on, Papa, I'll teach you. <laughs> <laughs> 